This week, the Waco Volunteer Fire Department had a break-in, resulting in almost $25,000 worth of items missing. We spoke to Assistant Chief of the Fire Department, Jason Rawlings, who gave us all the information. Sometime Tuesday night between 9.30 p.m. and Wednesday morning, somebody broke into our fire department at the Waco Volunteer Fire Department and uh, stole a bunch of stuff. Our value is about $20,000, $25,000 for the items that they stole. Some of those items were uh, two chainsaws, two steel leaf blowers, a Honda generator, an industrial generator, and a $10,000 thermal imaging camera that we used to uh, go in and search houses and buildings for trapped uh, occupants. That camera alone cost right at $10,000. We're not sure who done it, but we are offering a $500 reward for the information leading to the arrest and prosecution of the people that are involved in this theft. We're all volunteers. It's a shame that we, we use fundraising money to, to try to help our community and then somebody comes and does something like that to a volunteer fire department. But we're not condoning that it that, that it's right to do it to a community member or, or to a resident, but when you get a, a volunteer fire department that uh, that their members try to uh, raise all this money to provide the equipment to take care of our community and not only our community but all of Madison County, it just hurts because if you don't have that equipment when you pull up on the scene and it could cost somebody's life. Rollins said there's a $500 reward offered by the fire department with an additional $100 offered by Magistrate John Tudor to anyone who gives information leading to an arrest. For WBON-TV, I'm Marissa Hempel.